failed heist of Cyber City led to this once former great mafia boss to its end. However, a secret society managed to aid this crook to escape before certain death. Injured, the only way to save him was to turn him into nearly a full cyborg. Now, changed from his former ways, the crook boss now defends this secret society who saved him, along with an endless stream of robots pouring out from this one spot that they are sworn to protect. But clearly they're not doing a good job at it, like holy shit. So step one is to deal 75,000 damage with Crook Boss, and to do that, it's pretty simple, I just went to a Fallen Round, but instead of bringing any secondary DPS towers or anything like that, I just brought Jester, DJ, and Commander to complement the Crook Boss just to maximize its own damage. Yo, what's up guys, it's, uh, I'm back again, boys, and you know what we're doing now? Crook Boss, that's what we're doing. Slap on the Crook Boss there, and I'm gonna slap on the Jester. So, I should probably get my Crook Boss soon, because, you know, we're starting to leak some stuff here but i still have 240 health left which is quite a lot to burn so i'm just gonna get him right over here this little guard here takes out all those okay so this is going well now similar to some other quests in the past this one was a pretty slow start it was just crook boss early and then crook boss mid game and then Crook boss lake. Get. I'm gonna get confusion, confusion here on random. Oh, here's a tank. I don't even notice. I set him on fire, so the ice isn't exactly the very most helpful. But he got absolutely melted. So now it's just Jester's. I think those two as confusion should be fine for now. I want to get like one more poison guy. Now commanders max those out because why not? And that can be my full defense for this. So we'll just see how far it goes. But you can see here, crook boss damage has gone up a lot. By the way, look at that. Like, this is a ton of damage. And once again, like the getting kills with Ranger Quest in the Badlands Ranger video, the waves with the mysteries, because they don't have breakers in this map, it's old. This map has mysteries, so the mystery waves, would, because they would split into two different enemies, it would give a lot more damage to the crook bosses. And the same thing happened, where the damage just increased a ton and then slowed down a bit, but still got finished. We've almost completed the quest here, but I, I still do want to see if we can win Fallen. I think we can. Fallen is easy, and we do have Jester, so that's going to be really good. Uh, Jesus Christ. Why are they so fast, dude? Okay, this was... Okay, we died, chat. Unfortunate. This quest is like really boring. It's just, it's just literally you just play the game for five rounds. There's nothing crazy in it. Um, originally I started with Molten, but as you'll see later, I realized that that was stupid. Why am I, why am I doing Molten? So on the third round, I switched to, uh, to normal mode. And I also did normal mode for the fourth and fifth rounds. But if you're wondering why there's no footage playing right now, I will let past me explain that. Okay. Okay. Guys, guys, you might be wondering, right? But why is this different? Why is your Lodo different? What happened? What happened? Okay, so, so yesterday, I did three of the um, rounds to get uh, completing with the Crook Boss thing. Today, I've done uh, two more, and then I was I just started doing the Space City thing. Um, so basically, right, my computer has one of those like power buttons. Turn it on and off. It's got a button that's on top of it, and I stepped on it, and it turned off, and the, the recording corrupted. So, there goes that footage, I guess. Anyways, Space City. So, now, the quest is to beat Space City three times while using the Rook Boss. In theory, this shouldn't be too hard because, you know, you could just get some people together and then run some Fallen on Space City. Uh, but I figured that finding people in the lobby or whatever, and like party queue channels in the discords, whatever, I didn't want to do that. That's annoying. So, instead, uh, I tried to solo it. No. Like that. Turn off auto skip. And yeah, so this dude is just going to be spawning some crooks in, as well as just getting some damage off on these guys. These are going to be some pretty long fallen rounds, though. I can't lie. If I'm just waiting at the back here, these are all going to be like 
25 minutes, 30 minutes each. That's an hour and a half of just doing this. And I don't even know if I win this. So I may have to call in some uh, people. So I got another group plus there. Uh, he is in sync with the other one. Which doesn't matter too much, but it is nice just to have a little bit. Like, we just have double the guards there, and then I'll get them both to level 1 in a second. Because I'm just gonna, I'm gonna skip this wave. Uh, upgrade them both a bit, because we have bosses, or we have a boss coming in. Just gonna make them a lot stronger here, more range. Then they should be able to take out this boss with guards. There's actually two guards, I think. And then with another set coming through, they will be able to take this out, or just kill them. Most of the early game was literally just placing crook bosses. I managed to get all six of them in sync, and I got a level 3 one, and I started getting more level 3s just to help deal with stuff like Fallen's uh, throughout the early game. So, mostly, uh, crook boss kind of just carried me through the early game. Mid game, pretty simple. Commander, then DJs, then accelerators. And then, late game is just maxing accelerators. So, yeah. Get them. There we got a Fallen King. Hopefully I'm out of stunning range. These, here comes these Fallen New Guardians. That's gonna stun one of my commanders, but I have four. That one's gonna stun that commander. That one's gonna stun my DJ, I think, which is fine by me. I am gonna get another commander real quick because some of my commanders are getting stunned. I think that's a stunned accelerator. Holy crap, I didn't see this. Okay, if one of these is a boomer, I probably lose. Okay, we didn't get any boomers there. W. Okay, now it's just Fallen King. Okay, I'll, I'll, I'm just gonna start microing now. Where are my accelerators? I am losing. No. Wait, is that all my. Okay, crook bosses, you're coming too. That is close, though. I also just wasted 30 minutes. <laughs> okay. I figured that Ranger and Jester were going to be a better combo than Accelerator and DJ because the Ranger's got a big range so he can see more stuff and Jester can stall the Fallen King so, you know, more time plus more range is just the way to go in my opinion. Okay, fellas, so here we are in the last wave. Sorry, I kind of forgot that my mic was muted here. Um, but <clears throat> last wave here, we've had Jesters, you know, doing the stalling thing, the funny thing that Jesters are so good at. And um, this one still has that on. And yeah, it's been going great. I have gotten a couple poison. Okay, I'm going to rebuy you. Going to get a commander for that. Just so my rangers get some more damage. Uh, this guy gets moved down. Why is he glowing red now? Is this what happens in rage mode now? Genuinely, I don't know what this is. Uh, okay. This is also going to be another close round, but I think I should have this in the bag because we have two more Jesters here. Uh, it, basically, I lose this if he spawns Fallen's right now. Is like the only lose con, but no, we're going to get it. Let's go. You'd think that running the same strategy again two more times is the easiest way to win, but I don't know why, but um, for some reason... Like, it just, I, I tried more, and it really just wasn't working. Like, I did try them two more times, but, um, they ended up being, like, incredibly annoying. Uh, both of them were incredibly close rounds. I was tilted by the end of them, so I kind of just gave up on the whole solo thing. <laughs> uh, here, here's, what, here's what the rounds looked like.
so understandably, after losing to the boss with slightly over a thousand health left, I was pretty tilted. However, um, you may have noticed that in those two rounds, or in one of the rounds, I don't remember, but in the round, uh, you probably saw that I already had an extra one of those completed. That's because I ran around with my friends, which was fun. Hell. Yeah. Tyler, is there only is there only medium bot in me? Uh, yeah. But there's also okay. the the quadrants or like the the quarters. Yeah, those. Whatever those that's are that's like um, the quanta. I don't remember what the fuck they're called, but the the, the, the quartiles. The yeah. Did I even forgotten memories or lost souls or whatever it's called? Forgotten memories. Yeah, yeah. But let's run forgotten memories. Forgotten memories. <laughs> let's run that. Yeah. Let's run that. So. We we should have a forgot we should have a forgotten memories the game the game. Yeah, but I forgot it. I, I, I've, I've seen. Oh, what's the new one called? Like that they're actually. They haven't used. leaked anything other than that there is gonna be a new tower, and I think it has something. To yeah, do but with you're 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 a tedious YouTuber. You should have leaks. I, yeah, I, I have the inside information, guys. You should. Bro, is a tedious stuff. So. I think. Uh, I don't know what I think. I don't think. How are you gonna get time to run forgotten memories? If you can't even get them on FNAF Roblox co-op. Uh. Trust me. <laughs> Trust me. How is this gonna work? It just. It oh, just, look in chat. Look in chat. Alright, let's see. <laughs> Tyler, will you please run the well when Aaron Roblox game? Forgotten. And I think your your mic has a skill issue. I can't hear what you're saying. Yeah, it does have a skill issue. It does. <laughs> I yeah, I need to I need to. Oh, I'm so close to beating. Yeah. No. And with that, it put me at two wins. And then this is what happened before I lost, like, three fallen rounds to the... Anyways, so, uh, for the final round, I got out of the round where I lost a thousand health remaining. Got in the lobby, and some guy said, like, Hey, do you... Is there anyone who can help me beat the Space City, whatever, Crook Boss, blah, blah, blah. And I said yes, and then we did it. And, you know, it was... A standard duo fallen game, and we won it. So, yippee! Holy shit!